Dear teacher and classmates, let me introduce myself. My name is Holly. Today I am here to present to you about the role of business communication in marketing. My presentation is divided into six parts. I will start with introduction, then I will look at the function. The next is types of channels, strategies, considerations, and finally is hiring an agency. I will start with some general information about business communication. Business communication takes many forms. Company communicate internal information between managers or employees, while external communication is used to inform consumers about the company's products. Marketing is an important function for a new small business. Entrepreneurs and business owners must inform consumers about the goods or services they are offering. Business develop marketing strategies to deliver specific messages to consumers in the economic marketplace. Business often follow a few basic steps when creating marketing communication. These steps include creating a message, selecting a communication channel, sending the message and responding to feedback. Marketing strategies can also include an analysis of economic marketplace to determine the strength of consumer demand and the supply of products by competing companies. This analysis helps business understand how to differentiate the communication or marketing message from other advertisements. Business communication in marketing is usually delivered using a specific communication channels. Marketing communication channels include television commercials, radio advertisements, print media advertisements, and other traditional marketing channels. Information technolo technology has increased the number of marketing channels. These channels include websites, email, chatting, texting, and social media networks. Information te technology marketing channels increase the target market or demographic groups companies can reach with business communication methods. Marketing communication strategies are divided in two basic groups, direct and indirect. The business use a direct communication style by comparing the products to a leading competitor of the industry standard. This style allows business to promote the benefits of the products and why consumers will receive satisfaction when purchasing them. Indirect communication styles present a product feature and allow consumers to make up their own mind about the benefits of the product. An indirect communication method may be perceived by consumers as less of a, of a sorrow than the direct method. Business should carefully consider the receiving audience of business communication and marketing. Using a blanket communication channel or communication style may create cultural or societal confusion. Demographic groups usually respond to marketing communication in different ways. The reception of marketing message is often filtered by the demographic group, age, race, culture, beliefs, or other factors. Tailoring business communication in marketing can help companies avoid the negative situations. Using a professional marketing agency can help companies develop effective business communication in marketing. The agency usually have a copious amount of resources regarding economic markets, consumer demand and behavior and other information 
pertinent to creating marketing strategies. Small business owners may also develop a professional relationship with independent marketing representatives who can provide key insight on business communication and marketing strategies using several different communication channels. Thank you for listening. Have a good day.